you say, Ooh, who else coming out today? Okay. That's conversational. So your husband, is he buying the house with you? Your, your wife, your, she's buying with you, but she's not coming today. Make it part of your conversation. Who's doing this? What are we doing? Every conversation you have in real estate, whether you've met them at the grocery store, you're doing a cold call, it's a FISBO, it's a listing appointment, it's someone um, that you're having a conversation with about real estate. They, they have definitely inquired with you that they either want to buy or sell. These six things have to be answered before you can move forward. So the six things are, and I say these over and over, and I try to even say them fast in my head. Who is my first one? Who? Who is buying this house or who is selling this house? Are all parties present? It's everybody who needs to sign the stuff here. Can we get them on a Zoom call? Can we have them in, in a presence, like somehow, FaceTime them, something, right? So who is doing this? What, what are they doing? Are they selling their house? Or are they buying their house? Hey, I'm Robin Mann and I'm in Charlotte, North Carolina. I've been in the business eight and a half years and I do about 25 million as a solo agent and that translates around 60 deals or so. I've closed a home a week every week since 2016 and no paid ads, all organic networking via door knocking, Facebook. Those are the big ones, referrals. When? Is this like we're doing this next week? We're doing this in six months. Now, you're not going to ask these questions in this way. We'll do a little conversation where you can see how it works, but I just want to go through the what they are. So when, is this an immediate thing? Like if we can start or I need to call you back next week or next month. Why, why are we doing this? Why are you selling your house? You want to be near your kids. You want to start living the Lux life. You got a new job. You had a baby. Somebody died. Why, why are you buying? Same things. Why are we doing this? That one is key because when the people get frustrated with the buy or with the sell and you can say to them, Yes, John, we can quit this process. Yep, we can be done. Is that going to get you closer to your grandkids? Is that going to get you out of this house that's too big for you? I'm 100% here for you. If we terminate here, will that be moving you towards your goal of? So the idea there is you have their why, you have their ammunition. Same thing about why you sell, why do you sell real estate? If you don't know your why, don't do anything else today. Figure out your why. And it's not money, it's not kids, it's the why that makes you cry. Where, where are you going? Are we moving to down the street to Nebraska? Do you want a single family home? Do you want a trailer? Do you want an apartment? Do you want a townhouse? Do you want land? What are we selling? Is it just this parcel? Is it that parcel? Is it this place and this place? Where are we going? Do you wanna be where you can walk to stuff? Do you wanna be where you have to take a train? Do you wanna be where you can drive to things? Do you want a garage? Where is this? Are schools important? is where, how far is it going to be from your job? Does that matter to you? Where? Okay. And then how, how are we doing this? (laughs) Y'all got any money? Um, Have you talked to a lender like John Burke? Are you using cash? Have you checked your 401s? Do you have a down payment? Have you saved up money? Do you have enough equity in your home to do this? How are we doing this? Okay. If you can answer those six questions, you can absolutely a hundred percent move forward. If one of them is missing, you've just cut off your big toe. Okay. You can move forward without your big toe. It's just going to be a little awkward. There's something missing, right? It's just not going to kick right. Answering those six in my brain are essential. Now you don't sit there with a notebook and say, Hey, okay. And who are you? Okay. You're Michael. Okay. And is is it just you and your wife, but are y'all buying and selling this? No. Okay. No, it's conversational. When you're setting the appointment, You say, Ooh, who else coming out today? Okay. That's conversational. So your husband, is he buying the house with you? Your, your wife, she's buying with you, but she's not coming today. That's really, that's how are we going to make this decision? Is she giving you carte blanche? What man gets full decision carte blanche from his wife? Just need to know right now. If a man's out looking without his wife, I'm daring to say it. He's not allowed to do that. (laughs) The woman might buy without the husband, but the man ain't buying without the wife. I doubt it. And same spot, you know, same gender. I'm sure there's one that you're just not doing without. So anywho, make it part of your conversation. Who's doing this? What are we doing? Talk to me. Two ears, one mouth. Tell me what's going on. You say those words. All right, what are we doing? Where are y'all going? Are you so excited? Just don't, it's not a, it's not a checklist. It is a checklist. It's a conversational bullet points that you need to hit these in your conversation. 
Are you so excited? You got a new job? <gasps> right? Who, what, when, where, why, how? I'll see you tomorrow. I love you lots. Boom. Have fun. Enjoy your... Have a great day. day. Thank you. Bye, y'all. Bye.